here from all walks of life with a born and bred Grammy Muslim. It is so moving to see solidarity and compassion and humanity expressed with the people of Gaza and of Palestine by so many of our fellow Brits from all over the country, from every walk of life, from every race and from every religion. Our united message and the fact that this cause is so powerful for all of us and so dear to all of our hearts cannot forever be ignored uh, by those who wish to pretend it doesn't exist. The passion that is here this afternoon and the passion with which people have been marching and campaigning over the past few weeks has been utterly incredible to see. But just as powerful as our passion and the feelings that we have for our brothers and sisters in Gaza and in Palestine is the practical action that we can all take as British citizens to make our government and governments around the world sit up and take notice. And there are two practical ways in which I think we should all try our very best to make a difference. And the first of those, and you've heard very much about it this afternoon already, is about boycotting and getting involved with the boycott campaign. Last week, I was with 200 activists outside Sainsbury's in Union Street in the centre of Birmingham and we lay down in the street and we lay down inside Sainsbury's to say that we object to Sainsbury's stocking goods from the illegal settlements and that they must stop. We managed to close down that store for five hours. Silence, but we will never stay silent. So let's 